This conference will now be recorded. Hello friends. Welcome to BISPtrainings.com. In today's lesson, we are going to have a look at scripting in EPBCS. And I'm going to demonstrate the clearing of data command. We'll take two, this portion into two parts. First, I'm going to clear the data for one of the account by using clear data. And subsequently, I'll show you the clear block command. So let us proceed with our system. And I'm going to create a new rule file to achieve this. Before that, let us refresh it and see that we have relevant numbers available and it is connected with our server. So I'm jumping back to the rules. Go to your specific application. Underneath the application, just go to your specific cube, expand it, and just write the new rule for it. Give a name to it, any rule. Like I prefer the clear, clear data of volume. Clear data volume, I've given the name. And let us see how we can write this command. By default, your the rule is will open in designer mode. Let us jump to edit mode and write a respective fix command. So we start our rule and then fix corresponding to it. So let us start writing. I want to clear the data for F521 for these for this combination. So just typing, typing in the same, whatever we have at the top. So I have the plan, baseline, USA, USD. And because direct input is having the space, so keeping that in double quotes, one of the product as keyboard and FY21 because I'm clearing for premium month Jan to March, keeping it as it is. So by this we have created our fixed block and I'm keeping the volume of this as zero. Just validate this. So base base line. Base line, is, let us see, base space line. So keeping it and validating again the validation passed, deploying the rule. Deployment says, do you want to save? Yes, we want to save and deploy this. Deployment got done. I'm just playing the rule. After the playing, it will show you the status of the playing. This got complete. Let us go back and check the status of it. So we kept this as zero, the volume as zero, and we can see uh, the result also came out to be zero. In the next part, uh, in the next part of the sequence. I'm going to show you how we can use the clear block. So I'm going to take the full block of this. And let me put this number. Going back to the scripting. And as our block is ready, I can just write it. Clear block on. Let me just say that we can just 
validate this and once the validation got complete we can save and deploy deployment also got done successfully and play this rule on playing we should be able to see that there's no data available in our blog so rule ran successfully and as soon as i'm going to finish I'm going to refresh it. It should be able to show you us the new picture, which is the clear of clearing of block. That's it from my side for today. For today, thanks for your time. Have a good day.